Hello, hello, and welcome back to Leaky Gaming, and welcome back to uh, new people on our uh, little uh, planet here, on the little moon base, <laughs> Mars base, moon base, you know how it is, uh, back in the day everything was moon this, moon that, okay, food uh, is low, uh, that's uh, slightly troubling, so, new so, colonists have arrived. Uh, they brought uh, also food with themselves, so that's fine, we're gonna pack as much as we can now, and we're gonna go back, so what what do we have here uh, this guy should go and work automated mode uh, this guy is should work on automated mode than he is and uh, what else? oh here we go this one is paused because it depleted all the resources okay continue working on more resources arriving colonists we have 22 more colonists so now it's the number is 24 like I promised in the last episode we are gonna build up our uh, dome here so let's see what we can do uh, we, what do we need? If I was, if I was a scientist, what would I like? I would like research lab and the Hawking Institute. Okay, this is concrete, polymers, everything that we don't have. Um, doesn't fit in any of these. Okay, let's do it like this: taller buildings here, and then I'm gonna do a research lab laboratory, Dexter's laboratory. And uh, we're gonna have to build some spaces to for for our uh, colonies to live. Now in the middle, uh, our college. I'm gonna go with sanatorium again because I would like our people to be healthy. So I'm gonna go with this one. Uh, we're gonna need a lot, a lot more. For example, we're gonna need university. No, I'm not gonna put university in this one. Now living spaces. What do I go with this? Or do I go with something more comfortable? Maybe I'm gonna go with something more comfortable. So let's 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 try this. I'm gonna build a couple of these houses, housing complexes. So this would okay. Let's go with three. And of course, in the middle of all of them, it's gonna be a plonk, plonk and plonk, beautiful little park. Um, okay, those are fine. This is gonna put a lot of stress on our water supply system, which is already slowly depleting. Um, how is our water doing here? Okay, so this one needs to be repaired. So why is this not being repaired? Because it requires mechanical parts and our mechanical parts are nowhere to be seen. So we're gonna do this. Okay, hopefully this is gonna get resolved. Oh, you know what? Uh, let's do this. Uh, pause for a cause. Mechanical part. Yes, and you go and repair our water supply. But this is still not enough. This is still only uh, scratching the surface. This is um, maximum production of this one is three, I believe. And uh, we need four water. This is just gonna slow down. So, uh, next thing we're gonna do is build one more water extractor. So, let's put this one here. Let's do it just like this. And then I'm just gonna connect it to existing pipelines like this. And power supply okay i'm gonna assume that this is gonna resolve itself that they're gonna be building this on their own so it's gonna be fine but you know what they say about assumption um i shouldn't be assuming stuff yeah water water is not ideal on this uh, uh, uh on this map yeah we're gonna have to um, explore those prefabs and stuff like that. Do we even have any uh, scientists that can go and attend? Okay, here we go. Let's fa uh, fast forward this one. Carries fuel, really? That's an issue. Yeah, we still didn't build this one. Uh, requires, of course, polymers, polymers. go this should speed up our uh, polymer production hopefully yes people are slowly uh, applying for those uh, sanatoriums are working I think we can actually expand them a bit 
Uh, we have 15 people, but do we have 15 positions? Yes, we do, but some of them are officers and whatnot. So uh, let's do this. I'm gonna put this as normal, but I'm gonna open up night shifts on all of them. Uh, just so we have more uh, people applying, more uh, students going towards engineering, because engineering is the most important thing that we have that we need. Okay, power is dropping now, uh, but it should be fine. Yeah, minus 11 and uh, we have enough batteries. Right, maybe you should build some batteries here, but they cost polymer, of course. So, oh, food. Oh, wonderful. Resources are low. I see. 50% uh, to just started on this and this is seeds. Right. Okay, let's see if we can trade with our uh, neighbors. So this one still requires fuel. How many drones do we have here? Only three. We're gonna need three more. Which requires, of course, two stuff that we absolutely don't have. <sighs> okay. Um, let's put it like this. I'm gonna close one shift. I'm gonna put them on priority and hardworking. Close one shift. Put them on priority and hardworking. So polymers and electronics. Eight a day. Eight a day. Both of them are eight a day. So we need these little guys built as soon as possible. We need uh, this one built as soon as possible, which requires, of course, polymers. And uh, what else? Uh, here we barely have anybody working. Uh, but put a night shift here, of course. Night shift and on max screen. And here I'm gonna close two shifts. Yeah, this is the balancing we're gonna have to do from time to time in order to create uh, seriously. You're missing materials, you're missing fuel. We have 174 fuel. Why isn't this being delivered? And this one is full. Where is it going to unload? Is it just me or we have too many metals here? Okay, uh, what do we need? We need fuel. So I'm gonna send them here to collect all the fuel it can and bring it here, near the landing site. Okay, this one wants to land and it requests uh, electronics. Now this is gonna take forever. Forever, I'm telling you. Uh, Mayak. Uh, yes, uh, it still didn't pick up all the materials we have. Where are the... Yeah, I have to... <sighs> okay, let's transport this fuel first. We need to transport fuel uh, back near the rockets and uh, our polymer... I can't believe... We, our polymer factory stopped working because our... Incredible, just incredible. Uh, this is first things first. We're gonna unload this 45. Here we go. And after this, I'm gonna send it to get to gather all the rare metals. The rare metals is the thing we need. Okay, so rare metals uh, extraction was being. <laughs> wow, look how many rare metals we have. Okay, so we're gonna select this, and I'm gonna select rare metals and bring them back near our here okay now uh, that part is done so what do we need here we need rare metals of course yes why why would anybody and why would anything work perfectly in small limb and it can be complicated um on the other on the positive note we are getting uh, built our little drones our drones are being built um okay th this is gonna get back on track as soon as the uh, our little uh, rover brings all the metals. Uh, what do we need here? We need concrete, right? And concrete is being slowly delivered by our uh, drones. That's also not efficient enough. Well, we have more drones though now, so it's a little bit better if any, if, if that makes it well any better. We have a food shortage. 
Oh boy. Okay. So Soyuz is full. Um, does anybody want to trade with food? Here we go. I'll send you concrete, you send me food. Perfect. Um, Soyuz. Send. Okay. And of course I don't have enough concrete here. Right. Um, what else do we have? Brazil. Contact. Metals, no, and China, contact, um, they, <laughs> they go other way around. Okay, so we need concrete in order to, to uh, finish this trade. Uh, that's not going to be good enough. Uh, this is going to be done in within a day or so. Hopefully our people will survive until then. Um, let's, let's chance it. I'm chancing a lot of stuff here and I'm not really happy about that. What's our water production? 2.1 out of 3. Okay, so we're not still at the peak. Um, we're still gonna need Mayak. Uh, is it full? Okay, this one is delivering this. Rare metals. And now I'm gonna send you to collect concrete and bring it back here. Okay, here we go. Uh, this should work out. Uh, what about the... Mayak is now full. You can go back to Earth. We can land this one. That's going to drain our electronics department. And let's see how our research is doing. Right. Research. Um, we would like to... Okay, we already have 50% um, uh, moisture vapor upgrade. Yeah, we need to upgrade that one as soon as possible. A nuclear uh, reactor, uh, fusion reactor. Hmm. Yeah, that's being researched right now. Uh, starving colonists, I know, I know. And you, uh, it's not working? Why is it not working? The infirmary. We don't have doctors, we don't have... <sighs> okay. Uh, at least drones are built, right? Oh no, one more needs to be built. Uh, if I land this one, we're not gonna have electronics for a while. I'm just gonna keep it in a space for, for a few more seconds. This one is training engineers, not really. Yeah, we're gonna start the, the late shift as well, and uh, uh, we have a food shortage. Okay, starving. Hundred and eight out of hundred and nineteen people. Okay, they're less starving. Why uh, harvest came? Yeah. Okay, this one is going to the rival colony. Hopefully, this is gonna we're gonna survive. And also, I'm gonna see straight away to send it for more food. Uh, you whatever they require. I think it was electronics. Uh, then I might not. No people working here, who fully worked, fully worked, okay. That's okay. Okay, they're dropping, so hopefully when this is back, here we go, 109 food. Okay, they're not starving. Okay, well, kinda resolved, no? Okay, um, only four starving, two... One, there we go, no more starving people. And they didn't die, ha! Uh, you see what we can do, everything. So let's see, um, this one has to come back, I need to land this one as soon as possible. 
Uh, Mayak will have to bring more people. Are there any people living in this dome? No. Okay, we still didn't finish this dome. Uh, what about the bot botanists? Uh, not enough. And uh, here we go. You will land here. Okay, this one built all the drones. That's fine. What about this one? This still requires 12 and a half uh, polymers. Yikes. I'm kind of scared about this uh, because if I bring that rocket down, it's just gonna uh, swallow all our resources. So I'm thinking of getting a backlog of uh, uh, these resources, these electronics uh, that we're gonna need. Wow, this is all cramped in here. I don't like it. Uh, hijack throw, show me the enemy important. Okay. Uh, Think happy thoughts, little Joe. No attempts to resist when you reach the rover and open the hatch. Hours later, under your attentive care, the colonist uh, came back to reality and it's feeling better, uh, although ashamed. Effect, uh, Belka, uh, Jupiter has been saved. Okay, uh, just because we are... Okay, they recovered sanity as well. Uh, sanity is pretty high in this dome and this one also I think we are I think we're doing better I think we're doing better um, right so this one uh, so you just finish our um, food run and let's see who was that China I believe oh okay so we can no no this is it wasn't China it was Brazil no it was international right so we can do the same okay uh, let's can we do that as a uh, refueling so, yes. so this one is gonna have to go there i was thinking of doing that uh, regular uh, on a regular basis because every two days we can uh, fill in one rocket and this can actually be quite quite uh, good for us um now do do we transfer all our industries here slowly yeah that would be a, a really good idea i'm not sure how long this is gonna take so okay uh first things first uh can we actually build something from these buildings uh refuel refinery we can that's not a bad idea so okay let's let's build one fuel refinery around uh well uh, around burning rockets where they re-enter the mars and uh, launch uh, to go in the open space what can go wrong there uh, here we go. and maybe start decommissioning some of them from here I don't know. These things I would like moisture vapors. I, I can't abandon them, so I'm I'm not. Funding uh, received. Okay, this is good. So let's see what we have on Earth. Um more people. I think we should bring more people. So passenger rocket and uh, I believe oh we have scientists. We have everybody selected. Let's see if we have any filters. Specialization geologists. Yeah, we currently don't need them, so uh, I'm gonna leave it as it is, and I'm gonna leave them as they are because um, just launch. We're gonna need more people. Uh, they're gonna get specializations, uh, even if they are elderly. It's not a problem. I, I like all people. They're all welcome in, in my books. Uh, one thing I would like to put in here. So this sanatorium looks like it's getting empty. Does it mean that everybody's cured? In a lifetime cured people 47 that's a lot huh. maybe they are i think we're doing a good job um yeah this is the scary one uh how are we doing with the polymers here four and a half not too happy okay let's see if we have um we oh yeah we need to collect those uh polymers so let's you go here load resources and then go here and then here load all those resources 
And do we have any polymers here? Yeah, I'll, you just load those resources and uh, we'll see what we can do. Uh, you know what? Collect all of... No, 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 no. Uh, 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 sorry, sorry. <laughs> He's gonna collect the rocks as well. Uh, collect all of those and bring them... And bring them down here. And then we're gonna see what we're gonna do with you later. Okay, this one requires repair and that requires electronics and I don't think we have electronics. This was polymers, okay. Yes, of course, electronics. The boogeyman. Eleven point eight. I'm still pushing them hard on this one, and we are barely uh, making enough for our own needs. Okay, we have nine polymers, but some of them are in the in the little transport here. Six of them. Twelve polymers a day, working hard. Uh, what's the uh, sanity situation here? It's good. It's good. Uh, hopefully this is all gonna be used for building this and I'm pretty sure that we're gonna be missing oh no we're we're not gonna be missing anything okay perfect uh, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna build three more I'm gonna maximize our um, production but I'm, I'm gonna let them uh, produce that in time it's, it's, it's fine it's, it's gonna be fine uh, what do we have here we have uh, payload already to low land okay this is additional food uh, are we actually catching up with the food production we're not definitely catching up with uh, having more botanists that's for sure and this connection here i'm i'm kind of i'm not happy about this because our drone is on this side the drone hub and but we have it this one oh, it's, it's it's fine it's fine uh what do we need here we need machine parts we need everything we're not even producing that incredible do I stabilize our... Yeah, yeah, I, th I think I'm gonna do it. I'm just gonna do this and then uh, make them work harder and uh, hopefully they're gonna be happy about it. And maybe this one. Because working the late shift, are they complaining? Or are they not really complaining? And the polymers is something between you. Well, we need everything. Seven. This is twelve. Okay, let's see how this is gonna work. Okay, you continue building polymers. Also, I would like to flatten this area here because sooner or later I'm gonna plant a farm here. Uh, open farm, domeless farming. I need to research domeless farming. Is it this one? Yes, it is. That's fourteen thousand. Not now. That's a lot. Right. Uh, how is construction of these buildings going? Hawking Institute uh, requires, of course, polymers and electronics. This one requires electronics. So, in short, we need a lot of electronics and polymers, of course. <laughs> a lot of everything. So, um, yeah, the, the boost continues. So, we need to uh, let them build this as soon as possible. Yeah, but this is not forcing people to go to engineering. So, we're going to have to open this. Maybe lowering priority on this one then. So they equalize all the... Maybe except polymers. No, okay, okay. Let, let them equalize themselves out. So this is producing sh six machine parts. This one is producing ten electronics. And this is producing eleven plastics. Okay, that's fine. Uh, is this the one that brought us uh, Soyuz? No, that's for the mission. Let's see if we can send them another mission. Do we have... Okay, so... Initiate trade. And uh, yes, I'm gonna send this as many times as possible. Automated mode. Uh, there we go. There you go. Okay, I think this is it. Uh, Soyuz is gonna be transporting concretes. Now, concretes are of course problem. Because we don't have enough of here. 
Right, uh, fuel production, what's with this one? Uh, let's prioritize, well actually we don't have to prioritize this because it's getting all the machine parts I think that we produce anyway. Uh, the second thing I wanted to do is uh, build uh, this bad boy here. Uh, how far can I build it? I can build it pretty far, it's fine. Okay, this is fine. Cables to here, and this should be fine. They should supply it with fuel, and hopefully this is going to be built as soon as possible. And that's going to supply us with fuel, and uh, hopefully not create a water issue. Now let's check the water. As soon as it's built, fine. Let's see our potential production. Oh, it's still fine. Fine, fine. Okay, that's not bad. Uh, let's see here. How far can this one? We only have six drones here. I think that's not a good idea. I think I'm gonna switch. No, no, no just let me. How many drones? We have 46 drones altogether. Okay, Mayak is here with. Uh, okay, they need to finish the concrete. Oh, and, and I'm gonna land Mayak. Uh, Mayak land here. Okay, uh, are they building the... Oh yeah, I need to finish building. Uh, pause for a cause. Uh, we need to finish building um, infirmary. We need to finish building uh, art store. Electronics store, everything. Our scientists have to have anything. Everything. Uh, grocer, yes, of course. Let's put it here. We need a bar, big bar. Uh, first diner here and then we're gonna put a big space bar here uh, big park uh, so we have all a security station um, it's gonna create jobs but uh, I don't think we need jobs we have 45 jobs but that's without these buildings being uh, finished so let's let's uh, build a big park and let's uh, see if we can balance it later on so large garden next to the pub and that's it okay so you guys continue working on this one and i can't even uh, <laughs> stress this enough we actually are lacking New lagging colonists lacking. Have arrived. here we go uh, <laughs> I can't believe that I have problems with concrete and fuel. Guys, this is incredible. This is amazing. Oh, boy. <laughs> well, I don't. Uh, technically, we have enough concrete and we have enough uh, uh, of everything. It's just, uh, just complicated. Don't you just hate when it's just complicated? Okay, so let's build a couple of more of these uh, so they can clear out the rocks there. And I'm gonna build a couple of more of these uh, somewhere around this area here. Plonk. I just put it here, it's fine. Okay, we're putting a lot of stress on this uh, production. Okay, is that Mayak full? Mayak. Precious metals again. Okay, so we're gonna need more precious metal deliveries. Uh, yeah, not even close. Can I engulf both of them? I think I can. I just, I think I missed it. So if I do it like this. Okay, I'll do it like this and collect rare metals and bring them back near this launch pod. That should be fine. Okay, um, this one I'm not still letting you do anything with this. Uh, my yak is being refueled, ironically. Um, 2.5. We are putting more pressure on our water system. We're gonna need more, uh, more water in the future. Okay, this is no fuel for shuttles. Okay, it's still not resolved. Oh, this is going to be a problem. Oh, well, kinda. You stay away.
Yeah, I'm gonna need another rover and uh, this transportation thing from here to there is just not working out well for me. I also need to watch our power levels. Uh, yes, I think it's, the, the, it's not enough stress on the system. Last couple of episodes is just turning out to be stabilizing, stabilizing, stabilizing. So what is this one doing? Uh, this one is requesting uh, concrete. Yeah. This is putting a lot of strain on our uh, flyboys. Hmm. Yeah, they still didn't get this one. <sighs> How do we resolve this issue? Building another uh, fuel station here. I think actually that's a good idea. We need to spread it out anyway. But uh, nothing is using fuels here except them. But on the other hand, if I build a landing pad, which I definitely want to. Still nobody lives here. But still waiting for the... Uh, 11.9, 10.8, and 11.2. Okay. It looks like more people are being trained for those works, so that's fine. Sanatorium requires plastics. Uh, I think we need this one and this one as a priority. So electronics and polymers and electronics for those two. Uh, later on, I'm going to remove sanatorium as soon as we have. Actually, we already can order from Earth. Medical network, no, yes, network. No, maybe I should Resources cancel. Resources are this low. One. Maybe I should cancel. Let's cancel on this one. Uh, electronics, of course, it's always low. Uh, my yak, go back to Earth. Yes, Research complete. Here we go. Nuclear reactors that would be under physics, I believe. Uh, nuclear fusion. Uh, we can build fusion reactor. Okay, let's see what fusion reactor, reactor requires. So that would be under power section and uh, here we go, fusion reactor. It's not that bad. Uh, how much power do we get? 12, uh, 200. I think we got ourselves a deal. So a uh, fusion reactor is going to be built soon, but where? I would build it close to the domes because I don't want any um, issues happening between power delivery is there and back so maybe near the exploding rockets maybe even here can you plonk it here no <laughs> um, let's see if this is gonna work out okay let's check it uh, this one still no we need to stabilize uh, our dome. We have, let's check how many, um, let's check how many scientists do we have in our colony. So that would be somewhere here. Colonists and specialization and only four scientists. Okay, that's quite, that's quite low. Well, fine, fine, that's, uh, Resources I'm happy with low. this one. Um, is anybody living here? Still nobody? Okay, that's fine. Uh, what are they doing? Polymers. Oh, now China wants a trade. Uh, no, well, they want us to send them food for concrete. Technically, I can make, sell them 50 food for 50 concrete and then sell to the International Space Station 50 concrete for 110 food. Uh, that would be kind of cheaty. <laughs> it's not. It's of, of course, it's a mechanic of a game. Uh, the shuttle hub is still not working. Right. I know, I know. Left, right. Go here, go there. Go here, go there. Um, now what you're gonna do, you're gonna pick up uh, fuels from here and bring them all the way down here. We need this uh, drone hub operational. 
Uh, also, okay, it doesn't have. Oh, actually, it has. It has some uh, uh, parts here, but I think it's not working because of the because it's not supplied with fuel. So uh, we need this. This is gonna speed up. Uh, uh, well, everything. Please don't be concrete. The, the fuel. Uh, food. Food is fine too. Okay, let's see if we have any uh, spare drones. No, they're all recharging. They're all working. There we go. This one is going here. And then to this tunnel, and then we're gonna have fuel for our. We're gonna have fuel for our drone hub, uh, drone shuttle hub here. Uh, of course, uh, it's always low. Actually, the the we're covering with machine parts. That's nice. Okay, this is what we needed. Um. Metals 203. Why don't you go and automate yourself? Or uh, actually, you know what? I think you still have a lot of um, uh, rare metals here. Transport them. So, rare metals only from here. You don't have to bother yourself with the other one. And bring them all here. We're gonna need them for. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to bring the water vapor thingy uh, back soon. Okay, this is getting somewhat of a priority. I'm happy about that. So we're gonna resolve our power issue. Uh, and I think I'm gonna start recycling stuff from here. I don't know. It's already built, it's there. I'll just leave it. I know it's more trouble than it's worth because if Meteor falls there and cre or it creates some kind of uh, issues with the cables, that's gonna be pain in the rear end. Okay, so let's see how are we treating our workers. So let's see first the dome. Um, some buildings are not working because they don't have enough people. Uh, what about our Martian born are all also 50-50 more or less, which is fine. But we need more uneducated people to work in these shops. So what's with... Uh, okay, so let's close down the night shift. And... Um, Hopefully that's gonna create some people to work. Resources are low. Yeah. Why do we have two of those electronic stores? Building's not working. Well, nothing in this room, right? In this uh, dome. Right. Okay. Okay. Uh, I think uh, we did most we can in this episode, and uh, I'm actually seeing the progress. We just have to see how we can deal with this the best we need more electronics anyway guys uh, let's uh, finish it off here it's already 37 38 minutes and 10 seconds this episode guys thank you for watching if you enjoyed like button subscribe notification button leave a comment in the comment section i'm gonna see you in the next one bye bye